Jose Altuve, and we are ready for some daytime baseball. Swing and a miss, and it's a ball and two strikes here. That's not a pitch he misses very often. He knows he should have done something with that one. Ground ball right into the shift. Gregorius is there, and that's out number one. Here's Michael Brantley. Now the one and one pitch. And he turns on one, sending it high and deep to right. Not quite out of here. It's off the out-of-town scoreboard. 
And he'll reach second now with one away. In now, Yuli Gurriel. Hard liner to center field. Oh, and it eats him up a bit. And the runner from second will stay put at third, so they're runners at the corners now with one away. To the plate now, Carlos Correa. Slapped hard the opposite way. And a base hit, and that's going to chase in the run from third. The Astros are off to a 1-0 lead. Stepping in now, Kyle Tucker. Popped him up. Bohm is over now, and he's got it for route number two. And now here is Aledmus Diaz. And Houston looking for more here in just the opening frame of the game. One and one. Here it is. His past line against Aaron Nola. He's 0 for 7. Two and two. Guriel at second. Correa on at first with two down. He got him. Lively fastball that time. And it puts an end to the inning. Now to the plate, Gene Segura. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. The one-two. He swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. So now here is JT Real Muto. The catcher. JT Real Muto. All even now, two and two. Swing and a miss on the breaking pitch. Two away. Next to dig in will be Bryce Harper. Career line against Greinke. Two hits in seven tries. Harper. And that one yanked just foul. Here's Greinke's 1-2. As anticipated, here's a ground ball now to the right side. On to the first baseman, Guriel, and that will end the inning. So stepping in is Chaz McCormick. He'll begin things here against Aaron Nola. Heading out towards shallow right. Harper giving chase. He gets there and makes the play for the first out. Ready now is Martin Maldonado. Lifted down the line in left. And this will wind up a foul ball. One out, nobody on. Line drive to left but pretty much right at the left fielder as he takes it in for the second out. Next up for the Strohs, Zach Grinke. The 3-1 and one pitch. Taken, strike two. Two out, nobody on. And he takes ball four, so a good job out of the nine hole in getting on base as we go back to the top of the order. Second base Here's the 1-1. One, one. On a good pitch there. Had him stretching to get out there. And it's 2-2 two and two now. Hey, newsflash. Think he was guessing, boys? That will have to press pause. Is that strike three to retire the side? Last half of the second set to go, and that'll bring up Reese Hoskins. The 2-2. And right into the shift. Throw on to first in time, one away. Here's Andrew McCutcheon now. Career line against Greinke. He has nine base hits in 36 at-bats. He also has one home run. A little early, and now it's even at two and two.
swung on and lifted in the air to left center. Center fielder on the run. He tracks it down and makes the play to record the second out. So now to the plate, Didi Gregorius. Trying to make something happen with two gone in the bottom of the second. Now the 2 1 pitch. On the screws to shortstop, but caught to retire the side. And here's the left handed hitting Michael Brantley. We're all set to begin the third inning in this one. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. And he connects with it. This one's hit deep out to left center field. And that is off the wall. And the Astros get something started right away. It's a leadoff double. At the plate now, Yuli Gurriel. Can't find the zone there, and it's three and one. Carlos Correa will be next. And it's up to a three-two full count now. That's a pitch he'd like to have back. You're not going to see very many pitches like that from a pitcher of this quality. I'm sure he'd like to have that one back to take a swing at it. Another full count pitch home. And this misses for ball four. The second walk he surrendered here in the first three innings. Next up, Carlos Correa looking to follow up the RBI single from his first at bat. A ball and two strikes now. Swung on and missed. Really fooled him that time for the first out. Digging in will be Kyle Tucker. Popped into foul ground his last time up. Yeah, this one's going to upset him for a little bit. You make the pitcher work the way he did right there, and that's the end result. That one sticks with you for a while. Fastball misses in the dirt as he tried to get him to chase the low one. All over that one, but a little out in front. Foul ball. And he looks at a sinker for a called third strike, and now there are two gone. Next to stand in is Aledmus Diaz. Two on, two out for him here in the third. Maybe trying to back him up a bit there with the fastball. He's got a couple of pitches to deal with right here, but he's starting to lose command of his pitches. It might be time to take a step back and try to recoup. Well, the play's been made, and with it comes the end of the inning. Ready to go for the last half of the inning, and that'll bring up Alec Bohm. Now the one and one pitch. This is in the air to right. Tucker waits on it, and that's the first out of the inning. So the next to bat will be number 37. He'll take his first hacks here. Snatched out of midair at first base for route number two. Now to the plate, the pitcher, Aaron Nola. The 1-1 home. The bouncer to the left side. Diaz picks it up. Oh, and it sailed right over his head at first. And now, oh, this ball's going to wind up out of play. And a big mistake there. Nola at second with two down. Into the box now, Gene Segura. Can't keep the weight back, and he falls behind one and two. I love everything this pitcher's got working right now. He's got presence. He's got great body language on the mat. A swing and a miss. That retires the side, and that will do it. Striding in for Houston, Chaz McCormick. Ball and two strikes ball. now. Two strikes. 
to two balls and two strikes now. Here now the 2-2. Hit high and deep to left field. McCutcheon going back. On the warning track, he makes the catch. Up next, Martin Maldonado. Maldonado behind a ball and two strikes. Swing and a miss got him reaching. Real Muto recovers, and the throw to first is there to record the second out. Next, here is Zach Grinke. Worked a walk his first time up. One run, four hits. One error so far for the Astros. And it's fouled away. Pitch is popped up, and Hoskins is there to make the catch. The inning is over. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth. And next will be the power hitting catcher, JT Real Muto. Still a big bagel in that hit column. And this is where the frustration can start setting in on a team if they're not careful. It's never a good feeling when you know the guy out there on the mound is completely shutting you down. Yeah, guys, he's got so much respect for this guy's fastball, you could tell he was out in front on that slider. I think he goes to the well one more time with that. Ball. So we've got him swinging. JT Real Muto is retired leading off the bottom of the fourth. Into the windup, here comes the 2-2 pitch. On the ground to the right side, there is Altuve. Throw on to first is in time, and Grinky's got himself two outs. So next to bat will be Reese Hoskins. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. A swing and a miss as he chased with two strikes, and that will retire the side. Here's the second baseman, Jose Altuve. He's 0 for 2 with a strikeout in this one. And he can't get out of the way there. So the leadoff man will be aboard to open up the inning. Yeah, now with the plate is so Michael me. Brantley. Two hits in two trips for him thus far. And the good fastball there finds the zone as the count goes full now. Three and two. That's back toward the mound. This will be a tough turn, however. The throw will go to third. But he gets back in time, safe at second base. 